Hey everyone, Overkill's back with another video. Today, we got a toy review coming up of the Dragon Ball Super Dragon Stars Master Roshi. This is a newer release, and it is Master Roshi in his buff form. As you saw him some in the Tournament of Power, which is really cool. What we'll do first is take a look at the package. You can see you do got the Dragon Ball Super and Dragon Stars logos. That's all you're seeing up front. On the side, not much. Just a little Dragon Ball Super one up here. And on the side here, we do get some pretty cool artwork of Master Roshi, which is pretty awesome. And then on the back, we do see the wave, which is yet another Super Saiyan Blue Goku. A Broly. It says Dragon Ball Super version. I mean, I guess. I think the picture would tell you, but I guess for any new fans. And then we have Master Roshi or Mutant Roshi on the bottom. Now that that's out of the way, we'll go ahead, get this guy opened up, and take a look. So here he is out of the box, and the first thing I want to point out that he is really loose all around. You can see how wobbly his arm is here. This one's the same, the leg here's the same. This really wobbly figure, and I was warned about this by one of my friends who had got this figure. So be on the lookout, the hands even are, I mean, they just spin around in place, so that's kind of a bummer. Dragon Star usually does better than that, but, you know, I wanted to make a note. <laughs> it's got a helicopter propeller, everything's so loose. That being said, I want to point out that he has this hand that holds his staff, and he comes with a hand for the opposite side to do the same, which is pretty cool. And then he does have a fist on this side, and if you wanted to swap out... He comes with an alternate fist for this side, so you can kind of swap it out. And I thought that ain't nothing really to change out to show you, but you can kind of see how that would work. But we'll take a close look really quick. You can see the glasses. They don't come off, but the beard and stuff. The face looks pretty awesome. Got the painted on shirt and the belt. And this is his outfit from the Tournament of Power. When he threw down and... Got some pretty cool eliminations and stuff. Got the flip-flops going. And, of course, his trademark staff. So that's all pretty cool. The only other thing that he comes with, besides the hands I showed you, are a pair of open hands. And they're both the same. So he gets three sets of hands all together. And they all work with each other. I mean, he is the master of the Kamehameha wave, or the Kamehameha. Now that we've looked at all that, we'll take a look at some of the articulation. You can see kind of ugly joints at the shoulders. I don't know why they went with that approach, but it clicks. It's good. This part's tight. It's the part inside that's really loose, but you see you get some pretty good movement there. You can see how far out it goes. Just feels like it's going to pop out as you move it. He does have the upper bicep cut. Does have double jointed elbows. You can see the elbow kick out here. And of course you got the ball and peg movement on the hands. Because they're interchangeable as well. The head. Can't look up too far. It'll start popping off. You can actually start seeing the peg there. So you don't. I mean it's mainly for turning around. The neck gives a little. The waist. You know you get some movement. But this plastic piece actually hinders it a little bit because it's starting to push on it a little bit tighter that's a good thing he can do a decent split he's on a ball inside here as well no upper thigh cut he does have the double jointed knees though and the feet are the same as the hands where you get that ball that goes into a peg so it allows for pretty good movement on it no toe articulation so that is everything on the articulation wise. What we'll go ahead and do is set this guy up on the 360 turnaround, get a good look and do our final thoughts. So here he is on the 360 turnaround and I'm sorry he looks a little lopsided. Uh, the joints are really loose on the legs on mine so he wants to just kind of drift one way more than the other. So I'm going to have to try to figure out a way to tighten the joints up. But you won't see much more than what I've already shown you. You get pretty good look at the detailing um the clothes and stuff hinder a lot of the muscles but you do see he is pretty buff up top 
And they did really well with the face sculpt on this guy. I think that's the best part about it. That looks just like Roshi to me. It's really awesome looking. And I mean, I don't know how long it's been since we've got a buff Roshi figure. It's quite a while, I'm thinking. I can't remember um, of any otherwise. But this is really cool. And I know we kind of got two in a row. We got this one. Plus, we got the exclusive two-pack. That's the reason we hadn't opened this one, because I'll probably keep my two-pack sealed. But, you know, anything different, there's not... I mean, the shirt looks like he's actually wearing it. That's the only other thing I can point out. Like, when you look, it looks like it's two pieces of plastic instead. Like, it looks like it fits over it in certain spots. So, that's a pretty neat little feature. The skin tones blend pretty well. The colors look really good. You know, he's not really one to wear too many colors that pop other than his glasses and his staff so the rest of it's kind of blander looks at least his flip-flops stand out but yeah everything's fairly solid as far as appearance wise the negatives are definitely the joints like i said they're just horrible um you're gonna have to figure out a way to tighten them up or get lucky and get a figure that's not bad like that hopefully they can figure out whatever went wrong on this figure i've not had this experience on the dragon stars before so hopefully it won't happen again that's pretty much all i can say about it though it's gonna be a nice addition to my collection i don't have an open master roshi to set up with my figures yet so that's an awesome plus but with all that being said i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up i hope you like to look at this dragon stars dragon ball super master roshi thank you for watching until next time i bid you all Farewell.